Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Sid Meier's Civilization 6. My name is Michael Batman Guy and today we are back in um, strategy view uh, because it makes it a lot easier to spot the hills. I don't know about you, um, but these very cartoonized, um, what, what's the word, stylized, there we go, cartoonish uh, hill formations make it really easy to spot as opposed to when it's not. It's like, eh, this one's a little lumpier than that one. Especially when there, you add things like trees and silk and stuff on top. Because I'm looking for a hill next to a mountain on which to build the, whatchamacallit, Potala Palace. Now, it looks like um, Aachen is one of the few places that can build it. Um, I'm not sure, actually, does this count? No, that one doesn't count as a mountain. It's not... Not very mountain-like. I'm glad that uh, Civ 6 fixed that thing with the natural wonders. Everything is a mountain. Like, no, no, no. Ones that actually are mountains count as mountains. Uh, which means Aachen could build. Ur doesn't have a hill. Um, Uruk, also, neither of these are hills next to that mountain. Sipar, definitely not. Uh, Gursu could, but it's going to take uh, forever. Let's see. Yeah, 169 turns. That's... That's a lot. Return 177. That's almost as much time as I've been playing the game so far. Shurupak could definitely, and isn't uh, even worse than Gursu. Shurupak is currently the leader as far as time is concerned. Only 57 turns to get it done. But look at our options. We have here, and oh, oh, we can reach here. Was this not part of the plan all along? I seem to vaguely remember this. I was looking at that. Uh, you're going to grow there next. Nuts. Mm. Mm. Do we have... That's the wrong button. Do we have the thing to... Um, decrease the cost of... Purchasing a tile. We could do that. Um... But for just one tile? Is it worth it? I don't know of any other tile purchases I would like to make. I just know that 200 is a, it's a lot of money right now. And I'm already um, paying France for the privilege of their great work. Speaking of which, let's have a look. Oh, look, there it is. It's the only one I have. <laughs> okay. So, culture and tourism. Uh, we're doing excellent on the tourism front, by the way. In case you were curious. We are tied with Teddy at five. Um, I don't know exactly how it gets five. I mean, this says one tourist, but the tourism is 33. I don't know how tourism goes to tourists. At, I don't know, because this oh, 41 tourism is enough to get two tourists, but 40 is not. So that's a, literally a difference in one. But we also have different bonuses there. I No, we don't. We have the same bonuses. Nope, slightly less penalty for the different governments. Apparently, uh, Catherine's government is more different from mine than Movemba's. Whatever that means. I, I, I don't know. Just make things that produce tourism. That's that's the best I can, I can do there. I really, really wish they could be a little more clear how these calculations work. Somebody needs to make a guide dig into the numbers, do the math for me, because I'm not seeing it. Requires far too many data points to draw that very not straight line uh, graph there. So that's that's the plan. Um, yeah, we might as well make it in Shrewpack, especially because Shrewpack is about to be super safe. And this siege tower is um, really useless, honestly absolutely useless. So unless there's something we can make um, a good industrial zone not really um, I could see having this builder chop this forest to help with the palace but for right now I really want to put it here this is going to be by far the cheapest. Aachen is going to take 80 turns after the 30 something Oh no, we're down to 16. Okay. But still, 
I like that you can pan across the entire map, even when you're looking at the quote-unquote city screen for someplace else. That's kind of nice. Uh, yeah, let's do it. Yeah, forget, forget the siege tower. We don't need it at all. So put that there. Um, it looks like a lump. Um, actually, it looks pretty good. Here, we, we don't have the progressive um, images in the strategic view. So we could use our knowledge of now what this looks like. Imagine a sepia tone, black and white version thereof to see... Is that... That's a great library. Okay. This is... All these little things and you got the fancy bit on the top. Okay. Anybody else trying to build it? It would also have the little hammer on it. So they're building a theater square there. They're building campus on uh, library working on a library there I guess uh, what are you working on Chichen Itza yep under construction I don't know I might be able to surpass them if I had a good production city that was also had a lot of jungle I don't think I have one they can both build it quickly and build it in a place that it would be worthwhile and that's a holy site yes so Oh, oh, wait, hang on. Let's not discount Washington entirely. He does have... That's the Hanging Gardens. There are these places. He could technically build them. And this has no mountains to speak of. Okay. I think we're safe in this wonder race. Um, speaking of, just uh, for reference, Chichi needs uh, 65 turns. Yeah. Yeah. That's a little too much. Although, if we stuck it right here and successfully got those three, we could then stick the two theater squares next to each other. It'd be amazing. But what are the odds that I'm going to get that in 65 turns before Congo gets it? I, I couldn't tell you because I don't know how far along it is. Where is it? Right there. Looks like nothing. Maybe we'll have to we'll have to get some sort of scouting unit over there to peek on it. If he's not, if I can catch him in a couple turns, and see he's not uh, very far along. I might try it. We'll definitely push towards uh, more wonder boosts that way. And you, oh, you still have an attack. Go for it! Crush that warrior! Oh, he is he is most thoroughly uh, thwarted. Okay, move along. Let's see what they can do. Try to defend yourself. I dare you. You took out the scout. Good job. Uh, their catapult is hurting, but hey, they've done some damage. Good. Um, Congo has built an amphitheater. Okay, and America has pillaged a campus. So that's nice. However, the individual has some possibility of escaping from the power of the state. That is generally the advantage of the market economy, right? It's kind of a laissez-faire. Um, <laughs> note, it's only a possibility, though. It's not guaranteed, unfortunately. Uh, so let's see about that triangular trade, uh, since that basically replaces my previous one that was gold bonus from trade routes. So making should be getting even more income. I think that it has yet to roll over on that. Otherwise, uh, movement is starting at in friendly territory? Mm, nah. Um, but if there is a, a new wonder production bonus, uh, that's all military. Industrial zone, settlers, campus adjacency, harbor adjacency, ancient and classical wonders. Um, that's not what any of these are. New. No. Okay then I guess that's the best we can do. E yep. That's that's gonna be it. Ooh, look at that. All this bonus for being suzerains. Except, problem is, I need to be suzerains. Also, apparently my trade route increased. Oh, somebody must have finished a, a something, a harbor? Or a... Did you finish your harbor? Who was building a harbor? You guys. Not even close. Okay. I don't know who that was then. Um, 
Lisbon negotiated peace. Vemba has made peace. Um, we can get a thing with Faith. Still dealing with the housing crisis. And you need food. Of course you do. Uh, okay. So let's think about this here. We've got one Kniggit. Two Kniggits. Three. Three whole Kniggits. Why don't you go there? Get the city under siege. All from my own units. At least, right? One, dun, dun. Excellent. Got zone of control completely surrounding it. We're gonna shoot it in the face with crossbows. That does a scary amount of damage for being, you know, a crossbow. Um, what else do I have? I've got a knight up here. So you could get down there and conceivably get another attack in. You go there. Defend my latest acquisition. And that's doing like a third damage. That's doing a third of the damage. That's doing a third of the damage. I feel like I could take it in this one turn. Based on the, the damage indicators. Got three night attacks going here. But if I don't... I open this place wide open for somebody else. So let's play it safe and not do that. Next turn I will definitely have four knights to attack. Another crossbow shot. And in you... Can you go some... No. I'm filling all the available positions unless... I wanted to get my pikemen in there. But I don't think that's going to happen. So you just fortify it till healed. We will wait another turn on this. Okay? So you sit tight. Guys, just kind of defend yourselves. Hope for the best. Um, this is, this is, this is why. This American missionary right here is why I need an apostle. That jerk, he's coming from my capital. Which, um, still is not... Where's my missionary? Hey, you. Get over here and denounce Venice. There we go. Much better. Much better. Let's take a look. Okay, good. I finally have my core uh, fully converted. It's just, um, you know, the edge of the empire that is having some trouble. Um... You're getting there. You're getting there. It's, it's, it's on the up and up, so... Shouldn't be long. Shouldn't be long. Um, interestingly enough, uh, I think... Let me see. Uh, on the victory screen here, go to religion. Uh, Tamaris is technically in the lead. Oh, well, she was. Now, now I finally got my uh, majority there. But she has one out of her one city that's a whole sieve converted to Buddhism. Like, well, that counts, I guess. It's... The religious victory is a little little iffy there, because it, it's just purely by majority of cities. So really having a large empire makes it more difficult, like even just to spread to your own, as I've demonstrated here. I've spread out farther than I can uh, spread the religion. And I need more trade routes. So somebody should work on that. Problem is everybody's working on big projects. Sipar, you're two tunes away. But I promised um, something after the builders, didn't I? I don't remember what that was. And... You can purchase with faith. Oh, I do have enough for an apostle. Okay, yes, excellent. Get that guy. Certainly. And you can go... I don't know what to do with this guy. Um... Honestly, get, just kind of defend the town. Um, don't send everybody to the front lines just in case barbarians. Right? And let's see if we can't send these guys off to their death somehow. Here, you can go through my city. 
Oh, you're the, you're the builder. I meant you can go through my city. No? Maybe not? I don't know. Uh, this little knight. Go along there. And... Boy, this is just... Uh, a, a nightmare. To direct so many units. Why did I do this? Why? I was a fool. Well, it was it was worth trying. I have an army to back up my my words are backed with steel. Okay, it's you know it's not nuclear weapons, but it'll do. Um, took care of that. I I don't know where that came from, but I will get on the new traders uh, as quickly as possible. Again, everybody's working on big long-term projects like the Forbidden City. That's going to be good. Extra policies uh, were really going to help us, especially in that push for. Um, what are they called? Envoys. France earned a great profit, finally. Congo adopted logistics and Congo switched to autocracy. Ooh, okay. Gelinus is facing a siege. You don't say. You don't say. And what happened here? They killed the catap- no. Catapult moved. And you have made, like, no progress. Oh my goodness. You can't count on these people for anything. Well, I'd love to give you a promotion now, but I need to take this city uh, before someone else does. Who has the most XP of the knights? You do, so you definitely get an attack. Hit it until it dies! Ooh, that looked like it hurt. Ooh, boy. Okay, one more. Uh... 32, 27, 29, okay, 32, wipe them out, all of them, I mean, liberate the good people of Jelenus. Um, I'm I'm pretty certain that uh, everybody in the world will remember me because I will be victorious. You, yeah, they might remember. Um, literally nobody else met. We're not even going to talk about about these guys. You've never heard of them. They they never existed. Don't worry about it. Uh, keep city. Warmonger triple. Woo! If you raise it, let's not. Um. Keeping a player's final city is based on the surprise war penalty for this era. This value is doubled if capturing this city eliminates a major civilization. Ouch. But raising it is worse. Like, there's nothing else I, c I can do. I can't even not make this decision now. I've already clicked on it. I guess we're keeping it. Okay. Okay. What are they going to build there? They probably have to fix their granary. Yep. Do that. And we get to send an envoy? Nice. Okay. So, now that we're no longer competing with What's-Her-Face, right, I think now, like, Stockholm is now back to us because only got of the Mazingas 2 in there. Yes. Good. Good. Okay, Zanzibar. Okay, we need one to Zanzibar for sure. And that'll take over. And then, who else do we need to beat? Um, Lisbon I don't care as much, so I'm going to work on Brussels. Confirm. Awesome. Okay, look at that gold income. And how are we on our amenities? We... we've got... Uh, sheepstone weed... We've got the cocoa, the diamonds... Um... oh, exporting one. Okay, so total of one. We've got three cocoa. Because now I own two of them. Ah ha ha! Yeah! Right! Now I own the chocolate! It's all mine, and I got the cinnamon, the cloves, yep, yep, yep. Okay, we are set on minties. People love their shiny stuff. Good stuff. Good stuff. Okay. 
Um, so everybody, you can all clear out now. Go home. The war is over. Let's... let's you still don't like Teddy Roosevelt, do you? Um, you, you have these things. I don't have a place to put them, so never mind. And what do you have to offer? You have Chicago and iron. Teddy, you are a disgrace. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Housing. Housing. Yada yada. Now you need food? Wait, really? Why is it so... Oh, because you're like going all out on the production here. Um, good thought. Let's get someone to work this tile. Um... Let's see, this one for sure, lock that in. If we go here, I, I don't need the two gold. I definitely want this done faster. Okay. There, now you should be growing. 61 turns until growth. Okay, just, just ignore this. This is known to be a problem with updating. Player defeated. Um, you have a promotion. Oh yes, that's right, you come with a free promotion. So, let's see... Is there something... Hmm... It has to die in combat to get a relic. I hoping there could be some way to get a boost and still launch an Inquisition, because this consumes it. Right, I believe. Let's see, if we search here, Inqui Inquis oh, Inquisitor. But it doesn't tell me about launching the Inquisition. Maybe that'll be in this entry? No. Doesn't, doesn't say anything about... 110 strength, 3 spread charges. How many charges does it cost? I want to know. Like, is this going to... Does this consume all three of my charges? If I had extra charges? Like, if I go two extra spreads, can I spread, spread, and then Inquisition? Let's try that. Let's try that. I mean, n none of it is bad. I, you know, if, oh, I don't get to do the Inquisition, I just get spreads. Well, I'm going to send him over and beat up on that. Where'd that guy go anyways? I lost him. Oh, oh, oh over here, over here. He ran, he's running back home. Good! Good, I should just put a uh, blockade right there. Um, you, yes, you, you can, I don't know what. Go eat chocolate, I guess. I don't know. You try to get up there. I'm just gonna push forward. I guess you head over there. We get these guys kind of defending the, the front line cities now. Who don't have any walls? Only say prayers. Where is. Library, campus. We have to build the walls from scratch now. Because we destroyed them? Or did you. You had walls. You totally had walls. What? I thought they would be on the list of, of repair things. I guess not. Well, how do you like them apples? All right, you fortify there. You, um, oh right, I wanted to uh, spy on the Chichen Itza construction. Um, and you're already done. Okay. You are almost in place. I need a mine, but I need the mine right here instead. Can we can we make that happen? 
Question 45. Ugh. But it's gonna... It, 14 turns is too long. But do I really need the iron? No. No, I don't. I don't. We'll wait. We'll wait. It's not worth spending money on. What am I going to use that iron for? Why would I upgrade their units with my money? That's... That's... That's stupid. Let's... Let's send these guys back. We'll use them to bust fog. That seems uh, more sensible. Right? Just kind of scoot up there. Just kind of spread out. And yeah, just for maximum visibility um, on as much as possible. Okay. What? What happened? Apparently we established some trading posts. Awesome! Good. We have some trades uh, done and ready. You uh, go back uh, this way. Gotta save someone to fill in this, this gap in the middle. Okay, now next turn. I mean, French founded Catholicism right up. Oh, they just finished the Chichen Itza. And barbarians are raiding Chicago, as expected. Okay, uh, good luck, buddy. Wish I could help. Um, and we what? We promised not to settle. Yeah, we just we just captured other cities near them. We didn't need to settle our own. Yeah, not a, not a problem. And there goes the Chichen Itza. Okay, that answers that question. <laughs> right on time. Trading post done. And you can now collect your promotion. Um, defense or offense? Uh, let's, let's say against units. You'll be my unit destroyer. And of course, if you... Well... You get out of town. You get in town. You head there. And that means you go there on the hill. Okay. This trading post now... Hmm. You're going to need production. So Pokrovka would be good. Um, one, t two from Buenos Aires, and a lot of gold. That's a long trip. A lot of road. A lot of road. I think I want to do Prokovka. That's still four gold. Um, also in part to... Oh, a daub is even better? Really? To go way over there. Oh, that's quite the quite the trek. But I would get a uh, five. Oh, oh, here's three production with Kish. Yep, Kish always with the extra production. They don't even have their industrial zone down yet. Uh, let's say it's a toss up. It really is. I want that extra production for sure. Um, but is three worth the road selection here? Hmm. Because here's long-term thinking. Again, don't have much competition for this wonder. Really don't need to rush it too much. Everything I can do, yeah. But if I could instead get slightly less rush, but also get a trading post in Pro uh, Pokrovka. I always want to put an R after the P. Pro Krovka, because that would be, you know, professional level Krovka. Um, that would get all my trading routes even better. They would go through that and then off to, you know, Rao and Lion and that kind of thing. So let's say... Let's, let's start with that then. Let's do that. And it's only six turns, right? It's a short route. 
So we can change our mind and adjust from there. <gasps> Builder! Yes! Oh, good. Okay, now we can... Yeah, right, theater Square, right? Ooh, what is this one? Oh, that's that lake one. Yep, that's not happening. Theater Square! Right there. Delete that. Build it. Yes. It's going to be fantastic. And you're gonna go here, and you're gonna farm that. Awesome. And you are going to fortify until healed. You're going to go spy. Um, who's next? Who's next? Who's next? All these guys. Or, or just the one. You know, here, stand on that rice. Is that, is that it? Oh, you're back! And fully healed. Okay, but we are almost out of time. So, um, I'll, I'll finish, uh, these guys. And then when we pick it up again, we'll move on to the next um, decision point or probably even the next turn. My name is Michael Batman Guy. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time.